Happy Information Wednesday, Shalise McQueen here. Per my teaser video, I'm talking all about how insurance companies determine the value of your vehicle in the event of a total loss. And naturally, after all of the success last week with Barrett Jackson and them selling $203 million in vehicles, it's more important than ever to have this conversation. And this conversation is not just unique to whether you have a custom, specialized, unique, or rare vehicle. This also applies to anyone that has a traditional stock vehicle. So let's dive in. Let's start by breaking down the evaluation method insurance companies use to determine the value of your vehicle. And that is considered ACV, also known as actual cash value. And this figure takes in consideration, of course, depreciation as well. And how ACV is discovered or calculated, I should say, they look at your year, make model of the vehicle, you know, the wear and tear on it, mileage, any kind of options or upgrades you may have, and then of course, accident history. The ACV is what's used for insurance companies in the event of a total loss, as I was mentioning, and how insurance companies determine a total loss, quote unquote, is when they repair costs exceed a certain percentage of the actual value of the vehicle. And so in the event this is your situation, you always can use Kelly Blue Book as a good resource to determine your car's value. And they also have a depreciation tool you can use as well. That way you can understand or even combat what your insurance company is offering you. Now, how do you term, determine if ACV is what the evaluation method used by your insurance company is? Well, it will definitely state this in your insurance policy. And unless there's other items used or endorsements, such as new car, guaranteed replacement, a stated value, any of those items will, of course, determine a different value than ACV. But more than likely, if unless you have those endorsements or have a specialized policy, that is what you're dealing with is actual cash value, which, of course, equates to depreciation. And as we're seeing, used cars are going through the roof. So the reality is your ACV may leave you with some uncovered expenses out of your pocket. Even if you have a stock vehicle, but you have some customizations, not every insurance company will take these in consideration. Um, I have a product through Farmers and also MetLife that does and does provide coverage for customizations. So make sure you pay attention to that as well. But more than likely, if you have any kind of classic, antique, muscle, unique, any kind of rarity vehicle that we typically have seen at Barrett Jackson, you definitely don't want to have or rely on traditional auto insurance policy. A, you're not going to get the benefit from it. Two, it's going to be way more costly because these vehicles are not considered daily drivers. So you want to give me a call and I can, of course, give you a quote through a third party carrier that we offer, which is Haggerty, which, uh, which specializes in these non-daily driver specialized vehicles. And they give you actual stated value for your vehicle. So the value right now is $150,000. That is what we're insuring the vehicle for, not what will happen you know, a year from now, two years with a dent, scratch, et cetera. So make sure that you watch your piece and As I was saying, make sure you pay attention to all of your policy documents, what coverages you actually do, what you don't have, and what you need. And again, I'm your girl for all of this. So feel free to give me a call to audit your policy. Make sure you have the coverage that is unique and it's gonna be best suited for your vehicle. And as always, you can give me a call at 602-525-5665 or email me at cmcqueen at farmersagent.com. Remember to ask yourself, are you protected? We'll see you all next week. Next week.